The world is full of darkness and people are quickly losing hope. But as children of God, our case is different. The Sold Out Podcast is dedicated to give you God's thoughts and intentions for you. Thank you for joining us. Be blessed as you listen. Praise God. Thank you so much for joining us for today's special broadcast, our sixth day of the seven days of intensified prayer. Today we continue with what we began on Thursday, talking about supernatural help. Today I'd like us to look at another form of supernatural help that God has availed for us. The Bible says in the book of Romans chapter 8 verse 26. Romans 8, 26. Likewise, the Spirit helps us in our weaknesses. Likewise, the Spirit helps. Today we are looking at this other form of supernatural help. Romans 8, 26. Likewise, the Spirit helps. After these prayers, may you receive the help of the Spirit in the name of Jesus. Likewise, the Spirit helps us in our weaknesses. For God to bring man to this world, he took him through three very important steps. The first step was the formation of man from dust. The second step was the breathing of the Spirit into that dust. Impartation. And then the the third step the third step was endowing man with power the bible says and he blessed them and he blessed them and he blessed them genesis 1 god blessed them and said be fruitful he blessed them and then he said be fruitful and multiply i want you to look at these very important steps he formed them And then there were two impartations. The first impartation, the Spirit went inside them. And then the second impartation, the Spirit was over them. They were endowed with the capacity to be fruitful. Look at what Jesus did with the disciples. The first step, he formed them. For three and a half years, he spoke to them. He informed them. Because we are formed by being informed. He taught them discipleship, gaining knowledge. And then the second step, just like we saw in the book of Genesis, the Bible says that after resurrection, Jesus breathed in them. That is John 20, 22. And he said, receive the Spirit. Receive the Spirit. Impartation, impartation. So now, although they know a lot of things, he had taught them about the Spirit. Remember in John 16, he said that the Spirit will teach you all things. He had taught them, he had taught them, he had taught them. But he knew that they cannot do well without this second thing that he's doing now. He said, receive the Spirit. He breathed in them. The same thing that God did, he breathed in them. And then just like God in Genesis, he told them, wait in Jerusalem. Until now you have power over you. Until now you are endowed with power. A car can look very beautiful on the on the outside. A car can be well formed, but it will not serve its purpose without the fuel that is supposed to move it from one place to another. And even if you have the fuel, you need someone that knows how to drive the car. So knowledge and power are very crucial if we are to become who God has made us to be. When a man wants to impregnate a woman, he does not lecture the woman into pregnancy. We don't say five steps of, seven steps of, nothing like that. For a woman to be pregnant, there has to be impartation. Now, follow me, there is somewhere I'm going. There has to be impartation. 
something has to be received on the inside now not head knowledge something has to be received on the inside and whatever is received by the woman does not look like a child it does not look like a human being it is not attractive but that is what becomes a human being it does not matter how much this couple knows about pregnancy until something is imparted they cannot bring forth i value knowledge but today i want us to look at this other side the impartation of something where something is received not knowledge but where something is received this is how you impart your business to produce results not just by knowing how to do business but by releasing something to your business that might not look like the results that might not look like profit jesus said in john 6:63 the words that i speak to you they are spirit if you want your business to grow you must learn how to not just work with knowledge but with impartation something must be injected into your business not money not knowledge the words that i speak to you if you can just release words to your business those words don't look like the thing we are trying to get but i'm telling you whatever you want is in those words if you can just get words spirit spirit so today i'd like us to appreciate the place of the spirit the disciples have been taught by jesus but jesus is saying you will need help remember today we are talking about supernatural help tarry in jerusalem you have received knowledge but stay here until you receive power stay single i know you are you have read books about about marriage you are, you have been cancelled about marriage but stay single until you receive something there is something you need for marriage stay don't begin your business you have read books but don't begin that business until after knowledge you have received something there is something that needs to be injected there is something that needs to be injected so jesus told them jesus said don't don't start ministry you have the knowledge but don't begin ministry that is what jesus said until you receive this other help when this help comes it will not look like ministry it will not look like miracles actually when people heard them speaking in tongues they said these people sound like drunk men because whatever is being imparted does not look it, it, it does not look like it but this is where your ministry is this is where your marriage is this is where your business is if you can just prioritize not just knowledge but tarrying in jerusalem until something enters when god wants to give you ministry he gives you the spirit of that ministry not the seats in the sanctuary for you to begin he gives you the spirit of the ministry because inside that spirit everything else is there everything else is there ah joel chapter 2 and i shall pour out my spirit and then they will prophesy they will see dreams they will see visions if they can just wait for this spirit to be injected if they can just receive this spirit everything else is there you're wondering why am i failing in this thing yet i have been taught about it i have read books about it i have been counseled about it why am i still struggling in this area you need supernatural help the injection of the spirit labrasco praka most of you what you know is probably enough to begin what you need now is power the spirit is not just for preachers the holy spirit is not just for prophets the bible says and he shall guide you in all things after knowledge there is an impartation that you need from heaven you you know how to sing 
you understand all those languages and all those technicalities of music but after knowledge there's an impartation you need there's an impartation you need so jesus said tarry in jerusalem remember these guys had performed miracles they had cast out demons they had performed miracles but jesus is saying for you to effectively do this thing there's an impartation you need there's an impartation you need there's an impartation you need wherever you are i want you to begin speaking in tongues right now Lagos Cabro Kotobo today we are praying in tongues a lot today we are praying in tongues a lot Mara bombo zeke telegedi Niko te bagaya to ze bigiti kinika pato kota para bo ze begi mi lo bunga tika da baga maro bo ze baga da bo ze gedi mi lo bo ze baga da bo ri baga da mare gedi ba bo so bra ka teli gedi ba mare gedi bra bo so bra ka di 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 mi le di 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 Whatever you are, just pray in tongues. Pray in tongues, pray in tongues, pray in tongues, pray in tongues. In that Kalibo, Shake in Gadaba. Something must enter, something must come upon you. Ah, Yatus, Obadi, Kiki, Begada, Makore, Kataba. Malikusibe <laughs> After knowledge, there's something you need. 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 Marado Ose Parakata, Parusho Ketelikada, Maso Prakatikada, Maso Prikata, Sugeti. After knowledge, there's something you need. 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 Pressure, pressure, pressure. Parato Ose Kadi, Marigo Ose Prakada. Press in, press in, press in, press in, press in, press in. Press in, 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 Makati Zogodi, Maligo Ziprakata, Baraiko Sepada, Marakati Bo Zekata, Marakati Zokata. After knowledge, there's something that you need. 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 Maya do koseka, maraka ya dada, mako zeka da, mako eka da, marado zeka da, ilako zeka ya, marako zeka tika da, 
Press in, press in, press in. After knowledge, after knowledge, after knowledge, after knowledge, there's something that you need. 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 Magada bada bada ba. Majeka taya gada. Marago zekata. You need the spirit. You need the spirit. You need the spirit. Marado gozeka. Maragadia. Malegode. Mekayada. Marago zekada. Makayado gozekada. Makotaya dada. Mago zekada. Malego zekada. Taya kada bade. Mileko zaprakada. Marago tebada. Maribra zokodigada. Malako tebadigada. Marakataya daba. Press in. Press in. There is something we came for today. There is something we came for today. For an impartation. Maraga digada. Mato se kadaba. Marago digada. Marago digada bayada. Masega digada badia. I came for something more. More than head knowledge. 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 There is something that you need. There's something that you need. Maraka I need a fuel. I need a fuel. I need a fuel. My ministry needs fuel. My marriage needs fuel. My business needs fuel. Maragodia Ayakaka. Maragodia Dabaya. There's something that I need. There's something that I need. Beyond the knowledge. Beyond the knowledge. Beyond the knowledge. Beyond the knowledge. There's something that I need. I have been taught. But there's something that I need. Marubodia. Marubodia. I need something deeper. I need something deeper. I need something deeper. I need something deeper. Beyond knowledge. Beyond knowledge. Beyond knowledge. Beyond knowledge. Ay, 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 ay. Ay, 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 ay. You and 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 me only ghost. 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 My God, I need something. I need something. Beyond knowledge. Beyond knowledge. Beyond knowledge. Beyond knowledge. Beyond knowledge. Wait in Jerusalem until you end up in power. Wait in Jerusalem. Wait in Jerusalem. My God, my God. I need fuel. Fuel me up. Fuel me up. Fuel me up. I need some fire. I need some fire. Beyond knowledge. Beyond knowledge. Beyond knowledge, beyond knowledge, beyond knowledge. Mara baba baba shika da, mako shike diga da. Child of God, pray, 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 pray. Leka pakanda rapa sokude, leka pakanda repa sokude. Harose kando lika sobada, leka ndo rapo zakata, lako rapo zakunda pise, laka rapa papa sokote liba, leko rapo papa zika riba deya, lako zapara koza. Kide rakanda kosa paro kosi padia zo le kanda rapa papa soka da le koro posi kadi basora la karapa kanda liba rosa le karapa soko te parada da li kayando proski namaga la kosa pangari da zoko tida la karapa kanda li zo para i karapa papa pa rakanda baso kinda rakada paka zuda re kayando ropo si kada something more my God something more Holy Ghost something more the knowledge baro ko sipata something more than information baro ko se pekita leke repa kando sobe rika yanto ropo sikata something more than experience para kanta lipato makos kapana riza something more than education baro ko sipata ke leko mparos kapida makos e pekete riza leka rapa kadiza la komparadiza kata laka rapa sokote feel me up for ministry feel me for 
my assignment. Barakanda pizza te loco procori pasore. Makompa roko zepeta. Liko kandoza pira. La kampa rakasore. Akakakakaposa. Liko karapasoya. Leke repa konda pizza. Rako kon kapaza. Lika rapa kadada. Lika rapa kanariba. Liko poko zipata. Chaldo compressor. Chaldo compress tipa. Paroko zapikata. Liko parakatadia. Lika ripa da tosa. Lika raponza kida. Reke keke keya. It is the spirit that helpeth our infirmities. Pako pe kumpada. Leko pakatapa. Leke katukaza. Lakan kadiba soda. There is something more. Makonsa pikada. There is something deeper. Parakanda pizza. Rakon pokosa. Liko pokotebe. Something more than eight dollars. Parakanda pizza. Leko koparida. Rakanda pada. Leko ropo zigada. Leke keke posa. Leka pakada. Something more than you'll get in a class. Something more than you'll get in a lecture room. Something more. Rapoko sepete. Rankon kapali. Makaka kapanda. Lein kompadia. Rakan kankadia. Reke keke keya. Makom porokodia. Rei kompados. Rakanda kade. Leiko poko zeda. Leike in the kuza be. Leke keke pose de. Leiko parakataza. Leiko poko diva se. Leke keke pose kide. Iya shoko papasa kia da maso. This world will become an impossible place for you to succeed if you just depend on your strength. The Bible says it is not by might, it is not by power. When, when someone dies right now, when you look at them, they look beautiful. They have a suit on. They have their shoes on. Their hair is combed, but they are dead. Why are they dead? Everything physical is in place, but the spirit is gone. The spirit is gone. If there is a challenge, so, so when we look at you outside, people are praising your marriage because of how you look outside. But you in the house, you are crying. Be- no, because the spirit is gone. There is a challenge in the unseen. People are praising you, but you are crying. Why are you crying? Because the challenge is in the unseen. Something has been lost in the unseen. The Bible says concerning Obed Edo, 2 Samuel chapter 6, verse 11. The ark of the Lord remained in the house of Obed Edo, the Gittite for three months and the Lord blessed him and his entire household. All along Obed Edom was probably a hard-working man but something happened when on top of his hard work the spirit came. When the spirit came to his house what was happening in his house reached the ears of the king because within three months Not because now of the hard work, not because of the knowledge, not because of his masters in in business. Now, there was something that was added to his house. The Bible says concerning some lepers in the book of 2 Kings chapter 7. The lepers were going to this city to get food. The men of that city had as if they were chariots coming. You might not be a very good musician, but there is a way the men of the city can hear as if ah, ah, ah. you might not be a very skilled businessman, but something can come to your house, yes. like in the house of Obed Edom, that the men of the city will hear as if you might not be a very skilled wife. You, you have not read so many books on marriage, but there's something that can come to your house. You might not be a very skilled minister of the gospel, but with what you know, something can be added to your tongue that the men of the city yes. will hear as if yes. Supernatural assistance. 
Jesus said, tarry in Jerusalem. It, it is not for my, it is for your own good. Jesus is telling them, this is for your good. Stay here. I know you have, you have stayed with me more than any, any, everybody else. The disciples had stayed with Jesus more than everybody else. So if it was just to talk about Jesus, they were better placed. They had sermons prepared. They knew about Jesus more than everybody else. They had messages prepared. But Jesus is telling them, for you to be my witnesses, and, and you shall be endowed with power, and you shall become my witnesses. Jesus, why do we need power? Yet we have, been, we have stayed with you more than everybody else. We know about you more than everybody else. We know how you sleep. We know how you talk. We know how you sing. We know how you eat. Why do we need power? Jesus is telling them above knowledge, there is something that you need. There is something that you need. There is something that you need. I know you've gone to school for that business, for that course, for that investment, but there's something that you need above knowledge, above knowledge. There's a fuel that you need. There's an oil that you need. There's a power that you need. Right now, as you pray in tongues, may you be endowed with power. 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 Ragaduga Zakade, Maleko Kata, Mase Kata, Maroka De, Mezoka, Parai, Mese Kaduga, Melego Saga, Makoseka, Marakadia, Masoka, Marekadi, Meko Sekada. Maroko Zebra Kataba, Maganda Ramasa, Kundaliba, Sapa Katali, Le Komba Soka Kapa Rande Sekede, Le Kamba Kaso Koroke de Basoko La Pika de Yosoka, Le Karo Zapanda Lake Zopade, Le Koko Sakida Bahasa Kanda Liga, Le Kayanda Rapa Soko Rebekeda, Le Karapa Sakarabakanda Le Pereko Sapida, Le Kando Sapika Rakadadaza, Le Karapa. Son de lika re paro si pede le cora peso kanda li paro sa lika da le cara pa kanda ra pa pa so ka dia le kando si para kanda li paro se pika da le kayanto ri pa so ka lika da da pa sa le cara pa so ka li para gi da pa sa lika da le cara mbo se ke da pa sa kanda li ke de but you will receive power when the Holy Spirit comes upon you Holy Spirit come upon us now Holy Spirit come upon us upon us now holy spirit come 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 upon us now come upon this woman now come upon this young woman now come upon this young man now come upon this young woman now come upon this young woman now come upon this child now come upon me 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 now sanda kokori Kande pese li kare pa so koti pa de le kando so pe kita posa le kara pa kadi ba so le kanda pa kote pe de come upon my business now come upon my ministry now come upon my family now come upon my children now come upon every person masoko pa gida that is called by my name come upon us now le ngom ba kuta pese li kara pa 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 si kete le ke ke kimba so kote le ke Riba soko de, le kara pa kadi seke, le koro posi kata kata, le kondo posi kata, le ropa zuka da, le kore peki da, le kapa pa songa di, le kara pa kadi asori, le kompa di kaseira, le kompa kada ka. They had walked with you, makosa pika da. They had died with you, they lived with you, they walked with you, but they needed the Holy Ghost to come upon them that they would become witnesses. Let something come upon us, that we may become something more, that we may become something more, more than what we know, more than what we have learned, more than what we have experienced, more than what we have gone through. Come upon us now, Holy Ghost, come upon us now, 
now. Holy Ghost, come upon us now. Barando se pekete, li kande ko se pekeda, li kamba kando se pida, li kompa ko za pide, raka ka kanga diza, li koro koko ko pisa, paria zonka kapa, skem prekos kapada, le karapa kanda te, le kere pepe bezoya, le kapa kanda diza, raka usa pagata, raka nda ko se pekede, li kapa kanda kite pa, le karapa kanda sop, le kere pa ko za pada. Liko pakanda kade, le karapa kade se keda, la ko kunga pisa, raka kaka pakasa, le karapa kanda go, le keke poko sa pide, randa ta kase pede, le ke ya ko masakata, le karapa papa sa kada, le ke re pako so pada, le ka ya toro ko siada, raka nda raba bo sa kide, raba papa pade, le ke re papa papa, holy kosa, kama pona snaho. Makamba kompekida, roko kori pa sekete, lika rapa pa pa pa, reke ye kenga kuze, reke ke 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 ke, para ka ka ka, rako kundi beze, rea ko parose, reka rapa kade, rika yanga takaza, reke ke kari pa to, lika rapa kanda ta, let the Holy Ghost come upon us, transform our faces, transform our minds, para ke ke pe ke ti. Yo son pa Canada, le cosa para da si a cada, la canda so poco se pe, sanda paso cote. Rabo se que ti glaguze. Supernatural help. Likewise, the Spirit helps us in our weakness. Supernatural help. The Bible says in Ecclesiastes, chapter nine. Verse eleven. The race is not to the swift, or the battle from the strong. Nor does food come to the wise, or wealth to the brilliant, or favor to the learned. It is not the most beautiful girls that get married first. It is not the most educated people that become wealthy. There is another dimension of control. Our father, Pastor Dan, says the physical is controlled by the spiritual. The Bible says that as long as the hand of Moses was raised, they kept on winning the battle. Moses is not on the battlefield. The 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 opponents are probably stronger. They are probably more equipped. Mm. They are probably more experienced. But as long as something was being done in the unseen realm, lagus kadigos, rakuski aglas kuba krakaski debe, malegos kapros kubra kataya, zegina maglos kubra katis kata. In these prayers, mm. you are gaining mastery yes. in the unseen realm. Lagoze ke tele prakata, masobrogos kita labrokoza pada. May your small efforts avail much results. Yes. In the name of Jesus. Mm. It is not the most eloquent politicians that get elected, because there are politicians that are doing things in the spiritual realm. You will find someone shaking. Physically, they are shaking, and they tell you it is fever. Have you ever seen fever? But fever is shaking someone physically. If you can manage to shake things in the spirit realm, if you can manage to lock yourself in the house and shake things in the spirit realm, yes, people don't need to see you. Yes, they don't need to see you. Things will begin shaking in your business. Yes. Things will begin shaking in your ministry. Yes. Things will begin shaking in your family. Yes. If you can just do like fever, shake things in the unseen realm. Jesus said, "I know you know a lot about me. You have you have spent nights with me. You have eaten with me. You have travelled with me. You have watched movies with me. But don't talk about me until you are endowed with power." 
Don't try to minister. Don't go to the altar. Don't start that business. Don't get into marriage until you are endowed with something that cannot be seen. That is why your success is. Lago sapro kozebe. Hmm. Peter, there's a time that people left Jesus because they said Jesus was talking some strange things. And so everybody said we are leaving Jesus. We are leaving his ministry. The crowd left. And then in John chapter 6, Jesus asked his disciples, "Are you also not going? Aren't you also offended like the rest?" And then in verse 68, John 6:68, here's what Peter said, "Legaduska pras kuprokuze." Simon Peter answered him, "Lord, to whom shall we go? You have the words of eternal life." So Jesus, you have not just been giving us words. You have been giving us words that are backed up with something. That is why Jesus had, had said previously in verse 63 that the words that I give to you, they are spirit and life. So how do you maintain members? Not just by giving them words, because if they had gone to witness about Jesus, they would have the gospel that we would get right now will be a gospel of words so jesus said i don't want you to give people words yes remain here until you are endowed with power so that the words you speak are spirit and life the songs you sing yes are spirit and life yes how do you maintain customers in your business when when your business becomes not just a business yes. but a business of spirit and life yes we are rakus keblika ngros kape ila guska prakazike di bada when your marriage is a spirit and life marriage when your business is a spirit and life business when you are endowed with something that cannot be seen yes that is what will support what is seen that is the principle of roots roots go deep we don't see them but they are the ones that support what is seen child of god you have invested enough in what is seen makeup the latest fashion you have invested enough in what is seen but jesus is saying now wait here bariscopa tell god god anoint me to sing anoint me to do business anoint me to do ministry do you know even the devil the devil does not just work with crazy people it does not matter how crazy you are the devil cannot use you until he impacts you with his spirit that's why people receive demons because until you are spiritually empowered to be bad you cannot be bad enough for the devil you cannot be be bad enough to be used by the devil until he empowers you with demons you have to be spiritually empowered for you to succeed in this life whether in the kingdom of darkness or in the kingdom of light god did not send us in this world to serve him with our own strength no no how do you how do you allow the spirit to work through you one major way is by speaking in tongues And the Bible says that he that speaketh in an unknown tongue speaketh mysteries. He that speaketh in an unknown tongue is unpackaging mysteries. These things that are hidden. Your spouse is hidden. Currently your spouse is a mystery. Currently your next move is a mystery. Before I come to talk to you here, I have to speak in tongues. Most of the things that I tell you in this podcast, I have not written them down. I have not prepared for them but when I speak in tongues they are revealed to me if you don't speak in tongues you will continue operating by whatever is already in your hands you will not make progress not n- new things will not be delivered into your hands but when you when you pray in tongues new things are revealed to you new things are allowed to come to your knowledge some of you are saying this is this thing is too simple how can my future be revealed 
the Bible says that he has chosen the foolish things of this world. God has chosen to confound the wise through foolish things. By just speaking in tongues, do you mean I am, I am bringing my business into light? I am exposing my spouse? I am exposing my, my... How? He has chosen the foolish things. Every time you speak in tongues, you are bringing new things into, into existence in this world. Some of your enemies are hidden. You don't know who is fighting you. When you pray in tongues, they are revealed to you. People ask, how do you read the Bible? Hmm. How do you read the Bible for you to know, for you to get these revelations? How do you read the Bible? It is not in how the Bible is read. It is in the foolish things. It is in the foolish things. I'll tell you one other, one other secret to, to revelation is foolish thing, communion. The Bible says, that these two gentlemen walked with Jesus and they were telling him about him and they did not know it was him. They walked with him. They went to their house. They did not know it was him. But when he broke bread, their eyes were opened. It's a secret. If you want to receive spiritual things, spiritual knowledge, take communion, foolish things. The foolish things of this world. Take communion every day and see what will happen to your life of revelation. You'll just be knowing things. The foolish things of this world. He has chosen that by the cross people should receive salvation. The cross, a tree. A tree. The foolish things. Supernatural help is hidden in foolish things. How do you work and then give 10% away? But he has chosen the foolish things of this world to confound the wise. Tomorrow we shall have a full hour of praying in tongues. I just feel it is important for me to tell you these things. The people that advance most in divinity, advance by practicing seemingly foolish things. Aaron, you will not hear God. Yours is to hear from Moses, then speak what Moses says. And when you do that, guess what happened to, Mo to Aaron? He became the high priest. The high priest was the only one who was allowed to be in the presence of God over all the nation. The whole nation, only the high priest, will stand in the presence of God. By staying, by, by, by going down and saying, I don't have to hear God. I don't have to hear God. If my master has heard God, I will, I will respect what my master has heard. By that obedience, he was the only man permitted to go to the presence of God. Foolish things. If you can just embrace what is seemingly foolish. I'm giving you a key for supernatural assistance. If you can just embrace what is seemingly foolish, when they heard them speaking in tongues, they laughed. They made fun of them. Now, speaking in tongues is one of these seemingly foolish things. But when you pray in tongues, something happens. The Bible says you speak mysteries. Yes. You speak mysteries. Yes. All of a sudden, things that are hidden become exposed. You have not read them. You have not looked for them. You have not studied. All of a sudden, they become exposed. All of a sudden, you know things you did not know. You know things you did not know. You know things about business. You know things about marriage. You know things about ministry. Things you did not know. All of a sudden, you wake up knowing them. You wake up knowing them. You wake up knowing them. How? By embracing this foolish thing. Speaking in tongues. Speaking in tongues. Rakos if you can just enforce yourself in what is unseen if you can just enforce yourself in what is unseen what is seen will obey what is seen will follow suit what is seen will follow suit maroka sekata pareka to sepada mariko zepadia malekro koteba mako zepadia mako zekata maraiko sekada makres kotaba marego zekada Wherever you are, Lapanda Rapa Papa Seke Tekeliza Rakapaganda Libaro 
Zokohoria Zokata Lika Reika Zopa Kanda Gaze Leka Kakaganza Bika Rosa Boda Laka Rabakadea Zokode Leke Yakoza Pagarade Leka Rabakanda Rebese Leka Rapa Zopa Pakanda Libida Laka Rapa Zoki Deka Zopa Radada Lika Yam Paka Zepede Giza Raka Kaka Bakanda Gadeka Zode Makanga Dikese Lako Kokosa Kanda Kese Raka Kanda Kosa Y cuando caso corro José, le que repegue de que se pegue die, lica roca su pacanda, lica dosa, rapa cada caso para cada, raca ya cada y saco roco se llega, lica rapa cada cada cosa para, le carra pacanda ropa su cadiva suda, le que reca de su carabacaya, le que da su corre pegue da suya, raca caca caca se pide, le carra pacanda ropa se cadaga. Leka rapa papa suka ripa deya Raka kaka sanda lika doza ra Leke reka suka ripa da Leka rapa kanda raposa leke di Leka rapa kanda rosa Lika roko seke diga sofa da Raka yanga doza maka deya soko de Raka kaka gabosa kada da Rapa soka rapa kanda liga da Raka ya kanda ka soko de beria soude Rapa kanda roko de beseya Raka kaka kaka basa liga Lakarapa kaza kuna bize, raka kaka kaka basoko kaza kuna bize, lakarapa 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 kaza kuna b
to our mind. We don't know how to do it. Now let me show you how to do it. That that dilemma that you are in right now, the solution is in you. I'm not prophesying. I'm telling you a statement of fact. That thing that you want to know, the knowledge is inside you. The Bible says that by the anointing, by the unseen, by the unseen, there is this supernatural help that you know all things. Proverbs chapter 20 verse 5. Cancel is in the heart of a man like deep water. Every cancel that you need, all the knowledge that you need is inside you. Cancel is in the heart of a man like oh. deep water. If today you decide to start to go into the business of shoes, cancel is inside you. Mm. If you decide to go into the business of electronics, cancel is inside you. But look at the second part of the verse. But a man of understanding will draw it out. There is a way you draw out cancel from inside. I believe in asking questions. But why should I ask men before I ask God? Why should I seek? Why should I go to Google? I'm in the house. Sometimes you even don't have bundles. And you run to the shop, you get bundles, you come, you Google. Why didn't you ask God? You are with him there. <laughs> now listen, look at, look at this. The man of understanding knows how to bring out counsel from his heart. Counsel. Proverbs chapter 10 verse 11. The mouth of a righteous man is a well of life, but violence covereth the mouth of the wicked. The mouth of a righteous man is a well of life. The Bible says that counsel is in your heart like deep waters. Now the well from where you draw it out is through your mouth. Through your mouth. How do you I thought that you only know through your ears. How do you increase knowledge through your mouth? I thought knowledge only comes through the ears. How do you increase in knowledge through the mouth? The Bible says in Psalms 45, my tongue is the pen of a ready writer. My tongue. Psalms 45 verse 1. My tongue is a pen. My tongue is a pen. As you speak in tongues, Paul said, you are speaking mysteries. There is knowledge that will come to your mind as you speak in tongues. There are things that you are writing. My tongue is like a pen of a ready writer. There are things that you are writing down. A man of understanding knows how to draw out counsel from his heart. So when you are stuck in, your, in a situation, you are somewhere and you don't know where to, what to do, you don't know where to go, you don't know what to, what to do next, do this, sit down, relax. Start babbling in tongues. For inside you is all knowledge. But it is only a man of understanding that will do this. He knows that when I sit down, my mouth is a well of life. Kaluxeking angro kuskibia. If there is death in my life, my tongue, my mouth is a well of life. Oh. If there is a situation that I don't know what to do, my mouth is a well of life. Legos mm, 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 mm. I, I, I don't know what you thought you were doing as you were praying in tongues. But when you pray in tongues, you are releasing life into your life. You are releasing mysteries. Right now as we pray. May you may knowledge be deposited. May new knowledge be deposited. May new knowledge be deposited. Paradosco Prada. Legados, <laughs> 
konda baza le konda baza pa koroko si pekeda la kapa kada kasire le kere pa soko dia la kara pa kodo dike re kado sa peke le kara pa na la kase le kara pa kada kasa le kere pa soko diga rando sa pa kada sa le kare pe si kada rapa ya kada sope de le kando sa pa ga raka pa kara kade le kere pa soko da ya mare pe ya soko de rampa go sa pa ngalie re ka ya pa ra de da ra ka na go sa pe ge de le ka ra pa ka da go ra ka pa ka na ge se pe ra ka pa ka ra pa se ge da li ka re pa go sa pi ga re ka pa ka na go sa ra ka 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 pa ka di se re ka ma ka na li pa ro ge ra pa ka ta pa si ka de le ko ba ka da e ka na go sa pa go sa pe ra ka pa ka si pa ri ka de ra ndo sa pa ko le ge sa li ka ra pa ka na so pe da re ka po ko se ka li ka de ra pa ka na ra pa so ka da ra ka ya pa ka ri ya so ge de le ka ra pa ka na li ba ra ka ya pa go sa pa ga li ko ra pa go se pre ra ka pa ka ra bo se le ka pa ka ri ya so pa ra ka ba ka ndo sa pe de li ka ra pa ka sa pa ka ra pa 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 ba sa ka ba le ke re pa so ko nda ko se li ko 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 pa ke de ra pa ka na ra po sa ka da ra ka ya pa na ka se ke te re ka ya pa ka na re ko li ka ra pa 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 sa ka ta ra ka ka ndo sa pe ge li ka ra pa ka so ko da re ka ya pa ka na ra po se li ko ro ko se pe ge ro ko 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 bo so ko te lo ko ga po sa ko de le ke re ka ro ko sa ba ra ka ya ka na ko sa ke de ra ka 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 ta ra ma ko ngo ro ko se ke de ni ka ya ma ko sa pa da le ke re pa so ko te ra pa ko sa ka da ra ko ko bo so ko na bi ya la ka ra pa ka sa ka te le ka ra pa ko sa pi ka da le ka ra pa ka na ri pe de le ke re pa so ko de ra ka 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 di ba so ko de li ko sa pa ga di le ka ra po sa ka na ke ra ka na po sa pa ka da li ka ra po sa ka na ku sa li ka ra pa ka di ya so ke de le ke re ya ko ngo se ya man ka ndo sa po ga li ka ra po sa pa ga da le ka ra pa ka da ga se ga da le ka ra pa ka na so pe da ri ka ya ngo sa po ga da ra ka 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 pa so ko de ge de ro ka ma ka na pro de ske de re ka ka na ka so pa ga li ka ra ka nga di sa li ko nga po sa ka da ya le ka ra pa ka na si ge ra ka nga to ko so pa da re ka ya ko nga si ge ra ka ya pa ka sa ka ta le ka ra pa ka ndo se li ko sa pa nga di se le ka ra pa ka da ga so de re ka ya ndo sa pa ka da ya le ke re ka so ko di ba so ka da le ka ra pa ka nda ra pa pa le ka ra pa ka nda so ge da le ke re ka ndo ko sa ka da ra pa ra ko nda se ke te le ka ra pa ka nda ra pa so le ka ra pa ka da ga sa ka ta le ka ra mbo sa ka di ga so ya li ma ro sa ko bo ngo di ga ra ka mba ko sa ka pa da le ka ra pa ka da 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 le ke re ke de ge se le ka ra ba 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 bo sa ka da le ka ra pa ka nda ri pa so le ke re ka ndo so ko de li ka ra ko sa ka nda li ka ra ba 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 ra ka ba ka sa ki da da le ko nda pa so ko do go se li ko sa ka nda ka so sha ka da ka de so ko de how will you know in which location to open your business a man of understanding draws out this knowledge from the anointing that is in him listen to this the bible says for if ye live after the flesh romans 8:13 ye shall die but if ye through the spirit modify the deeds of the body ye shall live if you live from the invisible side not from the visible side mm. if you live from the invisible side you shall modify do you know what is to modify it is what they do to a dead man that even the hand is like becomes hard like a rock so the bible is saying you that is the, because we, we we really praise the flesh to say hey how can you live pure hey with all these girls hey with all this hey with all these things hey how can you be poor how can you be pure hey your your, your flesh is so active mm. your flesh is so active you can modify it that is what the bible is saying mm. to modify is 
when 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 they take the the body of a dead man and it becomes hard as a rock you know mm-hmm. modification so there is a way you can modify your flesh that is what the bible says in romans 8:13 how do you modify so you are in the flesh so although you are in this world is like we 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 draw closer and closer to where Jesus was. When the Bible says he was here but he sinned not. How can we walk closer and closer in that direction? By not walking from the visible side, but by walking from the invisible side. Now, one of the mistakes of us as believers is fighting the flesh. Fighting the flesh is living in the flesh. Stop fighting it. Stop fighting it. That is living in the flesh. Just live in the spirit. Pray in tongues. Draw up wisdom from your heart. You see, when when you just, you see, it's like a seesaw. When one side is heavy, the other one will go down. When one side is light, the other one will go up. Live in the spirit. Pray in tongues. Feed the spirit. The flesh will bow. That is the secret. The secret is not fighting the flesh. It is just feeding the spirit. Just feed the spirit. Feed the spirit. Building up your most holy faith. Praying. Praying. Praying in the spirit. Be, just build the spirit. The flesh will bow. That is the sick. So it is not 10 steps on how to stop pornography. Five steps on how to. No, I'm telling you. Remove all those steps. Build the spirit. That will mortify the flesh. That is the that was the Bible says. Romans 8.13 mortify the body by walking in the spirit yeah if ye through the spirit do mortify the deeds you shall live Ephesians 3:20 the bible says now to him who is able to do immeasurably more than all we ask or imagine according to his power that is at work within us it does not matter how much god loves you he has limited his activity in your life to the power that works within you god is all powerful but he does not only use all his power in your life in your life he uses the power that is at work within you who is able to do exceedingly abundantly above all we ask according to the power that works within us it does not matter how much powerful god is his results in your life are limited to the power that is at work within you. This is why we pray in tongues. Because when you pray in tongues, you are charging up inside. 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 You are building up yourself inside. You are putting fire on the inside. So that now you are availing power for God to use. God wants to do what? Exceedingly, abundantly, above all we ask or imagine but after all that he comes and checks what power is at work in you now understand the scripture it is not saying according to the power that is in us that is not what it's saying it is not saying according to the power that is in us it is saying according to the power that is at work because all power has been given to you all power is in you but how much of that power is at work do you understand now how do you work it out by praying in the holy ghost you are building up yourself you are charging yourself when you pray in tongues it is like a turbine you are putting that thing to work you are it is saying it is not the bible is not saying according to the power that is in you because all power has been given to you luke 10 19 and many other places you can see that it is according to the power that is at work put that power to work energize it let that turbine roll how as you pray in the holy ghost as you pray in the holy ghost as you pray in the holy ghost there is work that is happening inside there is work that is happening inside and now god is able to do what exceedingly abundantly above all you have asked or imagined are we together Lago se prakata. Let us just pray in tanks. Let us just pray in tanks. Sara bara 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 bara
Let that power work. Let that power work. Put that power to work. Put that power to work. Ma seke te li katara badiga seke de. Ma ra ko seke di gada la babu seke de. Ma ra bada bada bo seke di gada la gada ba. Ma re ke te li bra ko se pe kita la gro seke de. Ma ra ka te re pe te li katara pataza. Ma ro ko so pra katara badiga da. Ma re ba seke te li kita re bada. Ma re ko toro bada ba seke da. Ma re ko te bra seke ta bada. Ma re ko se pe kita la. Ma ra bada gada bada ba seke da ba. Ma re ba do se ke te li ba. Ma ko se ke di gara bada. Ma re ko toro pra katara kate bada. Ma se ke te li kra da ba. Ma re ko se ke te li ba. Ma ro ko te bra katara kata bada. Ma ko se pe ke te ri kata ba. Ma re ko se ke ti loka. Ma re katara badi gada ba. Ma re pro se ke ti la pro se kada. Ma ko se pe ki tara kada. Ma ka te re ba se kada. Ma re ko se pe ki da ba. Ma ko se pe ka ta ga. Ma ra ka ti so ko pe kada. Ma ko se ke te li kada. Ma re ko se pe ka ta ga. Ma ra ka si ke di gada. Ma ra ko se pe ki ta la da se kada. Ma re ko se pe ka ta ba. Ma le ko ro ko to pe ka ta ba. Ma ya ka te ba si kada. Ma re ko to pe ka ti ka si kada ba. Mara bada ba shika da bada ba, mara ko se pe ki da ba, mara ko se pe ki da ka da ba, mara ko se pe ki da ka da ba, mara ko ro ko se pe ka da ba, mara ko su pe ka da ba, mara shi ke di ka shi ke da, mara ko se pe ka da ka da ba da ba da ba, mara ko su pe ka da ka da ba, mara shi ka shi ke da, mara ka da le ba shi ka ba da, ya ka ba ka da su se ka da. Marika zeke te rika da, Marika kisu kuti gada, Marika dara pati gada, Marika kisu kuti gada, Marika lika da, Marika tila kaza, Marika zebra kada ba, Marika kisu kiti, Marika zebra kada, Marika zaka da ba, Marika zebra kada, Marika zebra kada, Marika zebra kada, Marika zebra kada, Marika ya te baza, Marika zeke te, Marika zeba da, Marika zoba da, Marika bara kada ba. Mari braso kodi, mari parakada, mazi prakadiga, mali braso kodi, mara kati bosika, mali bose prakada, mara kati zokada, mara kati zokada, makara badi kada, mari braso kodi, mali braso kada, mari braso kodi, mali braso kadi, mali braso kada, makase kadi kada, makase kadi kada, mari kada bada, mase kadi kada, makose kada, makose kada, makose kada, makose Rakadigada, makose kada, rakadigada, makose kada, makose kada, rakadigada, makase kada, makose kada. Rabose kete li prakata bada, rabose kete kada. Rabose kete li prakaze kete kada. Father, I thank you for everyone that is tuned in, wherever they are joining us from. Father, may you bless them. Father, may you increase them. Father, may you multiply them. Cause them to walk in the Spirit. Cause them to walk in the Spirit. In the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you so much for joining us. Tomorrow, we shall conclude our seven days of intensified prayer. We shall be praying in tongues the whole, the whole session. Tomorrow, we shall just be praying in tongues So join us tomorrow also from 5 a.m. Tomorrow on Sunday, yeah, tomorrow Sunday, join us from 5 a.m. as we pray continuously in tongues in the name of Jesus. Continue sending us your comments, your prayer requests, your testimonies through our number 0727-970-844. God bless you. God keep you in Jesus' name. Amen.